Salutations.
Good afternoon. What do you need?
How may I be of help? How y'all doing tonight, brother? Is everything going good tonight? Y'all ahead or behind or? Hey, brother. Dang, brother, you working fast?
Watch. Snacks can snacks can be kind of kind of a lot. It's usually a lot of pallets. What's up, brother? You doing all right? Thought maybe you're sleeping, dog.
Just trying to level my fury, Druid. I'm in public bail games. Oh, nice. Very nice. How you doing, Lesquidity? I'm just leeching Bale to level my Fury Druid. I'm just kind of taking a rest, I guess. Yeah, I'm pretty good, bro. What'd you get from Pendle? Yeah, maybe in a few years. Griswold's shield's pretty rare. I found a couple Mal runes. I found a Sir rune. I found a Sir rune, and I think it was yesterday. It's good, though, dude. Mav's chest. Kraken shell. What is it? Kraken shell, and then Vortex shield. Mav 
Hives is a set Kraken Shell. Grizz is a set Vortex Shield. Griswold Shield's really rare, dude. That's a really, really rare drop. Mavs is fairly rare. It's not not nearly as rare as Griswold. That's pretty that's pretty sweet though. Alder's chest is actually fairly rare too. I think I've only found one of those. Yeah, I think all the Grizz shields have three. They do. All of them have three. If you ever found find the uh, Griswold Catasius, it can roll from three to four sockets, I think. But yeah, I found a Grizz shield a while back off Pendle. I, I think Pendle's pretty good for finding that stuff. It's pretty sweet, man. You must have been doing a lot of runs, dude. Find that stuff. If you found all that stuff off Pendle, you probably had to, you did at least a thousand runs. Had to. Yeah, at least a thousand for what he just listed. That's at least a thousand runs. Maybe two thousand or more. A Griswold shield on average drops one in two thousand times off Pendle. Or, or, or worse. I mean, you could do 10,000 and not find it. <laughs> you could do 20,000 and not find it. I found one since I started D2R. Since I started D2R, I've only found one of those. That's cheating, bro. Yeah, that's a lot of runs, dude. You, you get, you get IK, you get IK uh, armor. It's only a matter of time. Just keep running the the pits or ancients tunnels or pendle. I ran ancient tunnels and pendle over and over. I, I found three IK armor so far. Only one. Two Tall's armors, three IK armors, only one Grizz shield. I don't think it's as grindy as Diablo 2, bro. <laughs> This game's pretty grindy. I mean, Path of Exile is really grindy too. Path of Exile is really grindy. But I don't know, Diablo 2 is pretty grindy, dude. I don't know much that beats it out on grind. It's one of the grindiest games. this game, there's really godly rare items that you might never find. There, there's there's rare items on this game, like perfect rares. Thousands of hours is just chunk change. That's not even as close. I'm talking about years, you might not find it. I'm pretty sure it's groundier than Monster Hunter. There's, four, there's a, like a a 4015 jewel, a 4015 jewel. I'll be honest with you, you're probably never gonna find it. There's there's jewels in this game you're never gonna find, basically. Thousands of hours is is small, very small number for some stuff on this game. That's that's like one fucking second. <laughs> Just, you know what I mean? If I could find a 4015 in a thousand hours, I'd be starting right now, brother. 
you know, like I said, there's stuff on this game you're probably never going to find. I mean, you can trade for it maybe if somebody else has found it. I've only found 140.15 my whole life. And I've been playing this game for 20 years. <laughs> it's all luck of the draw, man. You could, you could, you could. It could be your first character. You could find two of them. But they're, they're, like I said, it's all random. There's a lot of rare items too in this game. There, it's just completely random. Like you find, you're never gonna find one of the same rare. Like finding a five NATO. Uh, you could find a five NATO uh, rare druid helmet. And then find two or three more, they're all different. Like that. Every roll is random. So finding something that's perfect is basically impossible. Like you basically are not going to ever find it. There might be one, that, I'll be honest with you, I don't think anybody on this whole Diablo 2 Resurrected has found a 100% perfect rare 5 NATO helmet with, with max resist, max everything. I mean, it, maybe somebody, if they did it's... Nobody's, nobody's, they're not telling anybody about it. There's items on this game that like hundreds and hundreds of people for hundreds of hours aren't going to find. That's how rare they are. There's items on here that's it's basically impossible to find. You have to play, people, like on original D2, that people played years and years and years. Like every, the whole community, years and years, and there's only certain rares that was found, and then people would dupe those rares. Because those rares are so, so rare, so hard to find. The first person who ever found it, everybody just started duping it because it's so rare you're not going to find it. It's impossible to find. So, like, if whenever you trade for that godly rare, it's somebody, it's a dupe, somebody's duped it or something. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, there's, every roll is random, dude. So, like, <laughs> there's items in this game you're probably never going to find. Like, I'll be honest with you, you probably in your whole lifetime. Literally in your life, you'll never find it. doesn't matter how much you play, you're just not going to find it. I'm talking about really like maxed out godly rares though. It's uh, 40 enhanced damage, 15% increased attack speed, Jewel. They were really, really duped on original Diablo because they're so rare, the 40-15 Jewels. So in original Diablo, everybody duped them because they're, you know, like I said, it's so hard to get a perfect roll because when you find a jewel, what is it to roll 20 something percent to 40? Like you have to roll perfect ED and perfect enhanced. That's just a magic jewel. That's, don't, it doesn't even count rare items. Every rare item can have up, to have up to, what is it, four affixes? So like not only do you have to find the item, but it has to, every affix has to roll perfect. I mean like the chances of that's basically impossible. Like, it's basically like astronomical. It's not gonna happen. Or you'll see other stuff in this game you're never gonna find it, I'm telling you. It's just you're just never gonna find it. You'll have to trade for it or something. I'm talking about rare, I'm not talking about unique and sets and stuff though. You can find all those, but finding all the godly rare, that's different. It's a different story. It's not gonna happen. That's why really godly rares trade for so much. Everybody wants them, nobody's finding them. Like I said, I've only found 140.15. I personally found it. I don't have proof of it though. I wasn't, I didn't stream at that time, so I don't have proof that I actually found it. Dang, these games ended, man. Those were some good games. I'll be honest with you, bro. Start playing D2R, or start playing Diablo 2 or D2R like I've been playing it. Come back in about 10 years, tell me if you found, tell me if you found a 4015. Play it eight hours a day. 
for 10 years. Tell me how long it took you. <laughs> you might never find it. Play for 100,000 hours and you might never find it. No, it's a magic jewel. And it's not even the rarest item in the game. There's other items that are more rare than that. That's just a, a rare jewel. Yeah, Jim's got it, but hey, I mean, he's he's not a mortal man, you know. He's a uh, he's he's part of the pantheon, bro. <laughs> yeah, these games ended. That sucks, man. Those were good games. It's a magic jewel. It's only got two affixes. Just think about this. It's that rare. You know how many jewels drop? Like, every game you play, jewels drop. And that jewel is still rare. Imagine finding, and it only has two affixes. You just have to roll the prefix and a suffix. You have to have 40 enhanced damage and 15 increased attack speed. Even two affixes, perfect affixes, are that rare. Now think about rare items, like a, like a rare pair of boots. Think about a rare pair of boots. It can have four affixes. Not only do you have to, every affix has to roll, like you have to get all good affixes, but they all have to roll perfect. So finding a perfect godly rare is so astronomically rare, it's probably will never happen to you. Never, probably. Certain, I mean, you're, there's items you're just never gonna find you have to trade for because they're like really, really good rare items. I mean, you might, I mean, like, let's say you find a really good tri-res boots, right? One's got 40 fire resistance, one's got 37 cold, one's got 41 lightning. Well, it can all, let's say theoretically they could all roll to 45%. What's the odds of you finding the rare pair of boots? Every resistance, fire, cold, lightning, rolls 45% light. Everything perfect. The odds of that are so astronomical, it's, it'll never happen to you. And whoever finds that pair of boots, they'll probably be the only pair of boots that ever exist for a long time. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you're talking about hundreds and hundreds of, you're talking about everybody who plays Diablo 2 playing eight hours a day constantly. There's rare items that it's just so impossible to find. Like, it's, it, 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 would, it might take years to find them. I mean, not the perfect rolls. If you're just actually, unless you're like, well, I mean, you could gamble. I guess if everybody on Diablo 2 gambled and just constantly tried to gamble, yeah, you could get some perfect rare out of that. Perfect rares are really hard to get, dude. Even if you find a really, really godly rare, chances are it's not perfect. One of the affixes might be one or two off perfect. Like, to find, like, the best pair of rare boots with every affix perfect, with 30 faster run walk and faster hit recovery and try resistances, every resistance rolls 100% perfect. I'll be honest with you, like, you're, if you ever find that in your whole fucking life, let's, let's say you start playing Diablo 2 today and you play for, if you play for 10 years straight, if you ever find that, I'll be impressed. I'm talking about eight hours a day, like for years and years. I mean, if you find it, it, it that's impressive. I mean, that's, like I said, I've, not many people's ever found a 100% got, like a really godly perfect pair. Like, there's not many people can say they've ever found that. I mean, it's, it's like, that's like a fucking, that's like the fucking 100 club, dude. <laughs> I mean, if everybody on the planet played, I mean, you'd probably have a lot of people find it, but. I mean, like I said, finding perfect uniques is hard too. It's not impossible though. I found a lot of perfect uniques, but even unique items, if you find one, I mean, is it, does it roll perfect? Like Death's Fathom. You could find 10 Death's Fathoms in a row. None of them might be 100% perfect. I mean, like, and it's hard to find that. And you gotta, you probably have to play hundreds and hundreds of hours just to find that. Or, or more, maybe a thousand hours. You're gonna have to play, a, not a thousand hours. 
if you're if you're if you're running a hammer and you're running quick, doing magic find really really quick, you could find it fairly quick. I mean, you could get lucky and find it, but does that mean it rolls perfect? No, uh, not necessarily. You might find two, three, four death fathoms. None of them roll perfect. Like, imagine imagine playing this game. Your goal is to find every unique, all of them roll perfect. Every set item, all of them roll perfect. Every magic jewel, perfect. Every rare, perfect. Yeah, it's impossible. You can't find all that. It's literally impossible. That's what I'm saying. Not only do you have to find it, but it has to roll perfect for you to actually say, okay, I found a perfect. I mean... Yeah, I mean, it's literally, it's literally won't happen. Like, no one can do that. It's literally impossible. The only way you could find every item in this game perfect, including all rares, you'd literally have to go in and just edit and go in and just cheat the items in. Literally had to do that. Like, you're not going to find everything. It's just impossible. It doesn't matter how much you play. It doesn't matter. It's just... You look at the statistics, the numbers, it's literally impossible. Like, you're not going to have that happen in your lifetime. It's just not going to happen to anybody. The only way you're going to have all godly items like that, all godly rare items, all items, all godly, like even crafting items, you can craft. Let's say you craft a thousand amulets. You're probably not going to have any that roll perfect, what you want. You'll have a lot of good ones. You'll have a lot of really godly ones, maybe, maybe one or two godly ones. Even a thousand amulets, you might not even have one that's really godly, godly, like really godly. Like you want to get a 220 with maxed out resistances, all that. I mean, max life, mana, I mean, or strength decks. Like there's so many rolls on these items for every roll to be perfect. It's literally impossible. You you, you could roll, you could craft 10,000 amulets, not one of them perfect. And to craft those amulets, you have to have raw runes. You have to have you'd have to have ten thousand raw runes, ten thousand uh, perfect amethysts, uh, ten thousand like there, there's there's literally no way, dude. Like there's items in this game. I'm, I'm just gonna go ahead and be honest with you. You're just you're not gonna find everything, dude. <laughs> so yeah, this, I'm pretty sure this is probably the grindiest game I've ever fucking played, dude. I'm just telling you. You just have to play it for a while to understand how rare some of these items are. They're really rare. That's the fun of the game, though, dude. That's the fun thing about this game because you know you're not going to find everything. You could play this game for 20 years, and there's stuff you might find something like a, a really godly rare. Like, wow, I've never found that before. You know, oh, I've never – like like the other day, you know, I found that orb. I found the orb with uh, – Two sort skills, three blizzard skills, faster cast rate, life, and even that, it didn't roll even close to perfect. I mean, it could have rolled better. I mean, there's just, there, that's why people in this game collect, that's why people in this game collect rares, because there's godly rares that are so rare. Like, you could trade your whole character. If, if I'll be honest with you, I mean, you could have a a list full of characters. There's 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 a rare out there somewhere that's going to be worth more than everything you found in a fucking year, probably, just because because how rare some of these rolls are, dude. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if you go on YouTube, you'll see people that do like. 10,000 Pendle runs, 10,000 Bell runs, 10,000 Diablo runs. They don't even find even close to, you know. There's a lot of stuff they don't even find doing 10,000 runs. Like, And you got to think, let's say, let's say one run. Let's say you can do a Chaos run in two minutes. That's 20,000 minutes. And you're not you're still not even close to finding even every unit you know, even everything like much less a, like a really godly rare like a godly rare hell you could do a hundred thousand runs and not find like you could do a million runs 
and you're not going to find a perfect rare. You'll find really good rares, really godly rares, but you're not going to find a perfect rare. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> everything's, all the roles are random. Every affix is a random roll, so it's like it's like winning the lottery. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. A thousand runs ain't that much on Diablo, dude. A thousand runs is just like just a fucking everyday thing. It doesn't really mean that much. What's up, brother? You doing all right, Stride? I didn't know if you was going to come in here, brother. Let's see. If you're doing, if you do 10,000 chaos runs and you do two minutes per run, which is fairly quick, I mean, that's, you could, the quickest would probably be a minute maybe, but you'd have to be doing really fast seal pops. Let's say you're two minutes per run, 10,000 chaos runs. So that's 20,000 minutes. That's 333 hours. And in that time, you, you're not finding anything perfect. You don't even find one thing that's perfect. In 300, 400 hours, you'll find a lot of good stuff. You're going to find a lot of good stuff, a lot of good runes, but you're not going to find anything perfect, probably. I mean, you might. Not just that. Let's say you find, let's say you find two burr runes, right? That's going to take hundreds of hours, right? Let's say you get lucky, you find two burr runes. Let's say you use those burr runes to make infinity. Well, when you make infinity, that infinity has rolls too. You can roll... There's a variance on how much enhanced damage you can roll. There's a variance on all kind of different things. Like, you have to find those runes, find a perfect base, 15% ED, ethereal, thresher base, four open sockets, which that, I haven't even found that yet in all the time I played. Then you'd have to put the runes in, two burr runes, and then you'd have to roll that perfect. And that's not even the rarest thing to get. I mean, there's plenty of people with perfect infinities. Like, that's not even close to the rarest thing. I mean, you're talking about thousands of hours or, or more than thousands. Of, you could actually probably play 10,000 hours or more. Like, you, you might actually never... Just the luck of the draw, you might actually, actually never get it. And then you might get it on your first try, I mean, you You're talking about you talking about park T park. Oh, I have no idea. You know he can't really play 2K anymore because he moved. He moved out of that house, so he doesn't have good enough internet to really play it a whole lot. So he's probably going to be doing some variety streams probably, which should be pretty nice. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah. What does that man do anyway? Does Joey does Joey do anything? I never I've never I never see that man doing anything. He, he's got the life. What's up, Park? What's up, brother? We was just talking about when you're gonna do the next cooking stream, dude. You're gonna be tuning in.
Hell yeah. Yeah, that man don't do shit, brother. I never seen, I don't see Joey ever working anymore. That man's got it fucking made, dude. God, he's got it made. Where did I go wrong? That man's doing less than a salaried manager. Huh. Hell, that's pretty hard to do. My Merc fucking died? <sighs> Fuck. You get on my hammer, dude. Yeah, I gotta get that. I'm sorry, I hadn't got that yet, dude. I'm, I, I need, should I do that now? Should I do that now, dude? Should I do an emote stream where I make emotes? Do an emote stream. Pull up the editor, start editing my picture. Do an emote stream. I'm gonna do those emotes, I'm doing them. I gotta get that done. I gotta get that done tonight. That's gonna be good. Mm, bassinet. I'm getting on my gold fine bar. Fuck it. I'm gonna make some emotes before I go to bed today. I'm gonna get my bar online. Sipping for core hell yeah, dude. Oh hell yeah, dude. Corex is fucking awesome. Corex is the bomb, dude.
Should I just should I do those emotes now? I just need to do them now, don't I? I know y'all don't care about D2R. I know y'all don't give a shit about this guy. That's crazy, dude, like... I do appreciate y'all coming in stream and supporting me, though. I mean, I... Because I do know... I, I know that y'all don't really care about D2R, so... It means a lot that y'all come in stream, even though y'all don't give a shit about the game. It's really... It's really a good thing. None of y'all that watch me even like D2R. Y'all don't even really care about D2R. <laughs> Ooh, that was fun. Oh, yeah, I know. I know y'all played it. You played it when you grew up? I didn't know that. Yeah, D3, D3 is good. D3 is fine. There's nothing wrong with D3. It's not as good as D2, but not many games are. Think of your top 100 games of all time. All of y'all thinking all of your top 100 games of all time. Combine all those games together. Everyone who ever made those games, everybody, in fucking history of time, ever since games were created, ever since Pong, ever since before Pong, ever since chess, all that combined is not even close to Diablo 2. It, does, it doesn't even reach that pinnacle. It doesn't, it doesn't even come to that mountain. It's not even halfway up that climb, brother. Ocarina of Time is, is a drop is a drop in the bucket compared to the ocean of Diablo 2, brother. It's like a dewdrop rolling rolling off of a fucking flower in a garden, bro. It's not it doesn't even compare. It's like a grain of sand in, in, in the desert of Diablo 2, brother. It's a molecule in the universe of Diablo 2, how how great the game is. It's Oh, that game ain't even close, brother. That's like one Chrono Trigger is one tenth of Ocarina. Ocarina is one quadrillionth of Diablo Two, bro. Probably greater than quadrillion. It's a number I, I can't fathom. I can't fathom the number. <laughs> it's eternity. The number is eternity, bro. That's like comparing one second to eternity, dude. There's no comparison. It is overrated. It's a good game, but it is overrated though. Majora's Mask is better. Majora's Mask is a lot better. The only, the only reason everybody simps for Ocarina is because nostalgia. That's the same thing with Chrono Trigger, same thing with a lot of these games. It's just nostalgia. I mean, Diablo 2 is... Diablo 2 is, is a whole different spectrum, brother. It's... Yeah, Majora's Mask is a lot better. Majora's Mask is... Is the greatest. That's the, in my opinion, Majora's Mask is probably the best Zelda game of all time. In my opinion. Wind 
Waker. I never played that. I never cared for Wind Waker art style personally. So I just never, I just never cared to play it. Alright, brother, don't work too hard. Have a good night, brother. Link to the Past is really good, yeah. Link to the Past is really good. Where the hell's my mercenary? Get your ass over here! I'll say this, I, I can't really talk about Wind Waker because I never played it. I shouldn't say it's bad. I shouldn't say it's not as good. I've never played it. I can't really comp, comp, I can't really uh, comment on that. So I retract my previous statement. I've never played Wind Waker, so I, I don't know. It might be better. It might not be. Just never played it. I just remember Majora's Mask being really good, really good. Ocarina of Time was really good too, but I just remember when Majora's Mask came out, it was I just remember it being better. I just remember liking it more. Breath of the Wild, yeah, I never played it either. I heard a lot of good stuff about it. Y'all boys want me to make some emotes? Let's get the fuck off here. Let's make some emotes, bro. Let's make some emotes, bro. Y'all are going to bed, though, aren't you? The thing about Diablo 2, I'll concede to this. Um, I'll concede to this. The thing about Diablo 2, it's a good game in a different way. It's just addictive. It's an addictive game. I'll concede it's 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 not it's it's the best game in a different way. Like there's two different there's different definitions of best. There's best, like, really good single-player experience, really good story, really good... Which Diablo 2 does have a good story, but, I mean, there's different... There's different tiers. There's different... Not tiers. There's different parallels of best. And I think Diablo 2, in my mind, is best in the fact that it's just so addictive. It's like a constant serotonin hit. It's like... It's, it's just very addictive. So when I say it's best, it's not it's best in a different way. It's not really I mean there are games that are better than it in a different way. But I don't think there's a game that's more addictive. I think Diablo 2 is the most addictive game. For me anyway, I don't know. Some people might say World of Warcraft, some people might say other games are more addictive. To me, Diablo 2 is just really addictive. I'm about to make some emotes, boys.
Borderlands 2, that sounds pretty cool. Yeah, I know that game. Never played that. Yeah, because it's got the life steal on it. I think it's got mana steal too. It's not bad for low level. It's also got open wounds. Open wounds is really good. No, it doesn't have mana. Yeah, it has a good life steal, still good open wounds. Um, required level 17. Yeah, that's not bad for a really low level. RuneScape. Dude, I was just watching yesterday. I mean, y'all know that guy that got like six years in prison for saying something on RuneScape? For saying stuff on RuneScape? Y'all remember that? He got six years in prison, federal prison. The FBI, uh, the FBI went after him. Yeah, look it up, Josh Palalt. He went to jail in uh, 2012. He was in prison for six years. He made some threats to somebody on. Uh, he made some threats to somebody on um, RuneScape, and they forwarded it to Jagex, and Jagex uh, forwarded it to the FBI, and they raided his house. There were like 50 plus agents raided his house, uh, looked in his house. He was living with his mom at the time. I was, I was looking at the story, and he ended up he ended up serving like years and years in federal prison, like hard like hardcore prison. Yeah, it's crazy. True story, dude. Yeah, they, they made an example out of him. It's really crazy. I guess that just means just be careful what you say on the internet, bro. Something might happen to you. <laughs> Never know, dude.
No, I don't mean I don't really think about that. About to make some emotes, dudes. I'm gonna use GIMP. GIMP's free, right? Um, I'd have to look into it. They just, I don't remember. I'll be honest with you, like they evaluated him and all kind of stuff. I don't know. They they it was really kind of they really kind of did him dirty to be honest. But yeah, I don't I don't remember what the charges were. When he was talking to the guy on um hell. Yeah, when he was the guy that he was messaging on uh RuneScape, he was making threats. Like, not to the guy, but he was making threats to, like, a school and all kind of, like, some really, really bad threats or whatever. Like, he made, he said some really bad stuff. And like I said, uh, Jagex just forward, forwarded it to the FBI, and they just... And uh, they just raided his house, and yeah, I don't know. They they took they checked his computer they checked everything hard they checked his hard drive every I mean I, I don't know I guess they just found evidence I'm not sure it was it's kind of crazy though and I'm downloading GIMP. I'm going to make some emotes, bro. Yeah, just let your lawyer get there, dude. Don't say anything to anybody. If, if anything ever. I mean... Yeah, they possibly, yeah. Like I said, it was pretty. it's pretty wild, dude. It's pretty wild if you read into it. It's pretty wild. What should I do first, lol? I'm downloading GIMP now. Oh yeah, dude! I played Grim Dawn the other day on stream. Nobody seemed really interested in it though. So, Grim Dawn's really good, dude. I love Grim Dawn.
Dude, have you seen Lost Ark? What do you think about that game? I think that game can't, comes out today. Lost Ark. It's an ARPG. And sorry my screen's black. I'm just downloading this GIMP. I'm going to make some... Uh, I guess I'm going to make some emotes on stream, I guess. Yeah, I think it's free to play. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to play it or not, but it seems pretty cool. Upgrade system. Oh, really? Why do they do that? Dang, that's hardcore. What's like the percent chance to fail? Is it like 50 50 or? <laughs> that is pretty wild though. Where is GIMP? I just downloaded it. <laughs> should I shave before I do these emotes of me? Or should I leave myself like scruffy looking? The graphics seem pretty good on it. I'm probably not going to play it though because I'm too busy playing Diablo 2 or whatever. So how do I take a picture with my webcam? I'm so illiterate with this kind of stuff, dude. OBS? Camera? Uh, I don't know. I thought it was.
I'm looking tutorials up real quick. Okay, let me try this. Kicked you. What do you mean? I'm going to disable my camera on here real quick. And try to make a... Well, hold on. I need to try to figure out how to do it on here. Damn, brother. So how do I take a screenshot on Streamlabs OBS? I thought I figured there'd be a way to do that. It doesn't look like there is. Here we go, here we go. I'm gonna set this on BRB. I'll still be here, but I'm gonna I'm gonna use my camera to make some. I don't 
I don't want to screw with OBS. I'm going to try to make an, an emote real quick. <laughs> Can't figure it out. Hey guys, I'm gonna end the stream. I'll be I'll be back in like ten minutes. I think I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna do an emote real quick. It's not letting me use the camera because I'm using OBS. I can't figure out how to do it on here. <laughs> but I'll be back real as quick as I can.